So how hard it is actually working in the world of the present time? It's not hard if you think about it very carefully, but it might be very, very, very demanding in the other hand. And what I hear talking better, that standing against the wall, hours through the hours, might be pretty much just taking out your time. And what is a better thing to talk about like a time? Time itself is a concept of everything. Everything happens in time and we are part of the huge cycle of the universe when a time is one property of the transversion of the energy to the sum of the forms and the movement of the energy and the higher quality and molecule the different size of the energy for what is the, the, the real matter form and whatever. Let's talk about to the coldness of the winter. You will be freezing your balls in a cold night if you will be living of the high latitude country, especially in a somewhere close to the Antarctica. And when you are close to the Antarctica, there might be pretty too wet uh, to the exhaled area will be cold like a frizzy pole but still the water area what is still you not know, the liquid uh, the solid form like ice ice field or anything it still can be under G below zero to temperature weather but it's still keeping a liquid because there is so high movement of it it's so unfreezing water it usually can find out the rivers and some other places especially the surface of the some um, the cold days, whatever it is to areas, but whatever it I'm talking about this. Next problem is efficiency. You're looking for to have a laptop, computer, you're buried of the 24 hour. You don't want to be have a one computer, you want to have an unlimited CPU power. CPU power is a delivered by having a super powerful processor. You want to have a much better and powerful process than any other human being to just gain advantage because the advantage is always is the thing what you want to have when you live and you're selfish and you're individual and we want to be a god complex we want to have ownership every other people you want to know everything about other people and basically you want to nobody other people know anything about anything at all so you have a huge advantage anything other people you can manipulate them how it will be great Except I will be good at it for whoever I am, and it doesn't matter who I may ever are anyway. I will just go to the truth of the custom and say hi, and they will not make a check, and they're not going to go. They'll go let me through part because they wouldn't be to doing the work they have to call it a job. It's just a check of this of identification specifics, whatever it is. They just read me through. I never need to pay anything at all. I just ask to get. They never asked me to pay anything back. Nothing. And I'm saying, oh, I can't get anything I want or get any service anytime. Just manipulate it to trigger into some page posting me that all right, everything is alright, there is nothing. So they have to be here. What is the technology with the end up with this? You will be sad charisma is one of the things one might be getting over. Advantage as a speaking skill, but I have a conclusion it's not work to everybody, unfortunately. It will be meaning that I need actually some more technology. I need to brain manipulation. It's more about to the somehow I can myself control how other people's brain biology narrow mechanisms work. So the narrow impulse of the mechanism there will be some limbic system. I will be control far away, remote control brain device so instead of I need to tell I can far away it's not in as we'll say there is a lot of ways to have a different to go inside friends we can have an invasive ways where you usually taking some kind of mechanical gadget stick anything and then just using a radiation well the radiation is great but how I can have enough powerful radiation which is using leave a trace and go inside and change something? Well, perhaps the other thing is 
to big laboratories, nation, countries, companies, corporations, laboratories are all working about all kind of the different technology and improvement. But I am all up for one of myself to do it to all the advantages and all the good instead of the this so called socialist communist which benefits to more like a society. It's what every country seems to be. So you're looking for yourself to all the advances instead of to other people's. Even though there might be very good a chance that as far it's not a doubt but to something physiological effect that all the goods applicated are very much that you will be yourself also get good just to make it good things other people's or not just other people's but to let other people just do good for things for you you don't need to do at all anything the same cause it doesn't matter who do the invention of course they can manage it to gain it but after all the old goods when it will be divided after using this technology will be after and I will be making a conclusion that what is the point of all this technology at all we don't need any technology everything is just what are the are the diseases of me we don't need to improve anything we can accept accept what they are so they are so we don't need to do any work